What's going on guys, Uche and Joku, Sneaker Principal, and uh, I'm resting. So, uh, my main hashtag on most of my Instagram posts, especially those having to do with me um, working out and taking care of my health, usually says, no days off. And I believe in that. Um, the human body was meant to move. And I've always had people tell me, well, do you overtraining, you overdoing this, you need breaks. And my philosophy has been, no, it's not about having breaks and cheat days. It's about being intentional every single day. That's what I mean by no days off. Um, so that means doing something every single day that is intentionally for your health. Um, my typical week, I'm up as early as um, 3.30, 3.45. There are days where I'm up at 3, sometimes 2.45, and I just cannot help it. I'm up. Um, and um, what do I do with that time? Because the gym doesn't open till 5. I engage in things that I believe will only enhance me. Not exhaust me, but enhance me. So it might be, whoa, I have an idea for a video. Yeah, I'll script it out and I'll sometimes make it. Or there are times where I might just say, you know what, I, I want to read something. So I'll grab a book from my library and engage in that book. Um, it might be um, literally doing nothing but just meditating, which is not doing nothing, but just being in the space of silence and allow myself to vibe in, in the in the sounds of the early morning. Um, then I make it to the gym by, by by five, and while most people are still sleeping, I've done more um, over the course of an hour, hour and a half, sometimes two hours before going to the gym. And I know even when I set foot in the gym, there's still most people that I know are still in bed, and they're aiming for 6 a.m., 6.30, in some cases, 7 to get out of the bed to get to work by 8. Um, but not me. By the time it's six, I'm back in the house. I'm getting ready. Seven, I'm picking up my kids, dropping off to to school. Then I'm at work, and I'm usually at work till about I would say about seven o'clock in the evening. Sometimes later. And again, this is what I do. Um, day in, day out, week in, week week out. On the weekends, um, I um, go to the gym, light workout, or I might go for a long walk. I engage in something every single day. But today, I wanted to find what rest is for me. Rest is not a cheat day. Rest is not, I'm not doing anything. Rest is really being engaged in a space where my mind and body are connected. Um, making sure that everything that I do today, you know, honors the concept of principle of making sure that I am not taking I am not taking advantage in a negative way of the blessings that I've been given of health of this body, um, of this present reality. So today I've been I've been doing a lot of deep meditations, talk, talking to myself internally, checking in with myself. Um, but then not only that, you know, making space for me later on to go for a walk. Um, or do something that doesn't have to be high intensity, but allows me to just live in the present. And that's something um, that we don't do enough of. Some of us run nonstop. Some of us just keep pushing. Some of us keep worrying. We keep engaging ourselves in ways that are just so detrimental that we wonder why we are not feeling well or that we're, why we are breaking down, why our blood pressure is so high, why Things are just feeling are feeling chaotic. So um, I've chosen to like no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to be intentional, you know. And the moments that I feel like I'm not honoring that that intentionality, I check myself. I do check myself. I ask myself, Uche, what are you doing? Why? What? Why are you allowing yourself to be in that space? So um. I just want to implore you watching this to ask yourself, how are you doing?
do you need a break? What does a break mean, you know, for you? What does it mean for you to rest? Is it literally taking a nap? Is it just sitting there quiet for a few minutes, a couple of hours? Is it just diving into a book? You know, is it walking to the beach and just standing knee deep, waist deep in the ocean and just being, you know, I believe that once upon a time that those kind of activities were ingrained in us and expected of us walking and getting lost in the walk, you know, being a, getting lost in a thought, you know, coloring, drawing, I don't know what it is, playing, you know, because the great thing about those things is that those things allow our bodies and our minds, our spirit to heighten, allowing us to grow. You know, I can work out all I want to work out, but if I don't find time to let my body and mind really mesh in the purity of blessings that is bestowed upon us for just being alive, then I'm doing myself a great injustice. So today, today resting has been just sitting still, enjoying the quiet of this place and this space. I hope you do something for yourself as well. Ah, uh, y'all. Luchin Joku, Sneaker Pencil, and I'll talk to y'all soon. Be well. Peace.